have uh, discussed about this uh, release of uh, the carbohydrates proteins in detail um, in your most of your lectures sir but uh, you have never talked about the importance of fat i mean the fats and how much yeah, they should did. be consumed Re except for the ghani oil yeah yeah no uh, oils are the fats so we recently released a video my daughter in conversation with uh, sarala we talked a lot about oils and um, yeah i think you people should watch that video carefully and uh, all things can happen naturally and uh, we have told different places different oils so italians can eat olive oil and uh, indians can eat uh, north indians can eat uh, mustard oil and uh, south indians see south india is much more diverse we have umpteen number of oils is like uh, safflower uh, niger oil uh, sesame seed ground nuts and uh, all these kinds of wonderful oils and this saturated unsaturated omega of all these things are all specific uh, food culture this industrial food culture people are throwing at you all these things but we have inherently wonderful system to manage if you eat the right materials and that have to be natural and untouched by this so called uh, scientist in uh, making it hybrid varieties gmo varieties all these things should be avoided and you you are fine with all the oils that locally you can grow and process them in a natural way and that we have done lot of experiment and we found that ghani oils bull driven ghani oils are the best and when you consume we have actually reversed many of these diseases like parkinsons alzheimers and autism and paralysis uh, all these bad conditions of nervous disorders have been set right uh, to wellness in thousands and thousands of kids and thousands of patients hence we declare that's what i keep telling i declare that this is the only way you need to get oils not even the so called machine gana oils oh it is wooden only they say but it is not real cold press because that stp standard temperature and pressure can be maintained when you have the rpm of bull driven or one or two rpms only then you have the condition standard temperature and pressure maintained and that happens only with wood even if you have stone uh, gana a little heat is generated you understand that it's okay it's better than many machines uh, but uh, many places where there were no uh, there was no no, no trees uh, in olden days you can see the granite stones were used for the uh, lower uh, base of the mortar and pestle the shaft is wood and then that's okay that's okay but if it is complete wood is the best there are no two things about that yeah this is about oils and uh, all the minute details that it is there in the cod liver oil and it is there only in olive oil all those are all not completely scientific because each and ever local area will have its own oil supply by god so Absolutely. it's you have to recognize so actually you go to canada and america there they have pine nuts if i can have pine nut oil enormous human they don't want to touch that they're all bothered about this refined oils in the packets and then they are eating and they are they are suffering that's all so you see they don't need olive oil americans you know they have a lot of pine they are simply throwing they can make pine nut oil and that's good for them no problem at all so god has given us different places different oils and this cold weather you go to punjab they grow mustard simply grows you cannot grow as well as you grow in north we can also grow some mustard here but the way it grows there is just like that it grows so they have the luxury of uh, making mustard oil let them make mustard oil and eat good very good it supplies lot of things that you require there is no problem at all thank you for watching